Welcome to the 2013 graduation ceremony at Stanford University's Graduate School of Business. What you have accomplished at the GSB, you have not accomplished alone. First, you're sitting shoulder to shoulder with your classmates as you have throughout your time here. You have forged bonds here that will become lifelong friendships which will nurture and sustain you in the years ahead. In a time-honored tradition, you have declared yourselves to be friends of R.J. Miller. It would be remiss of me if I did not say how honored we are to have with us the Vice President of the United States. I have left the most important for last. This is your opportunity to stand and say thank you to your friends and family who are celebrating your mutual accomplishment here today. Please join me in giving a warm GSB welcome to John Donahoe. I want to share with you four simple leadership principles that I've learned over the past 25 years. These timeless principles have helped me navigate my work and my life, and I hope they're helpful to you. Link your work with a sense of purpose. Never stop learning. The most valuable learning often comes in difficult times. Build your full life, not just your work life. Having completed all of the academic requirements of the program, this year, 80 Sloan Fellows will join the worldwide family of Stanford Business School alumni. The Ernest C. Arbuckle Award is presented to a second year MBA student who is nominated and chosen by his or her peers. The recipient, by his or her active participation, initiative, leadership, and personal integrity, is seen as having contributed most to the fulfillment of the goals of the Graduate School of Business. I am delighted to present this year's Arbuckle Award to the Mama Bear of Section 6, Stephanie Collette. Congratulations, Stephanie. The Alexander Robichek Student Achievement Award in Finance is given to an MBA student selected by the finance faculty, not only for outstanding achievement in, but also for their contributions to the finance courses. This year's recipient of the Robichek Award is Jackson Garten. Among the R.J. Miller scholars, one student's achievement places him or her at the top of the class. This student is designated as the Henry Ford II Scholar. This year's recipient of the award is Stuart Philip Lim. I wish you the courage to continue to dream and to soar no matter what obstacles are put in your way. I hope you will stay as tightly knit as you are today and that you will continue to support one another in your aspirations. I'd like to ask all of the graduates to please stand one last time and be recognized. Thank you.